jurisdiction over various real estate related cases, housing codes, building codes, landlord tenant law, zoning issues, testified in about a thousand of those type of cases. I also was the administrator of the court and managed the budget for that particular court. 40 employees, $2 million annual budget, each year approved by a local legislative body, and I never went over budget, not even by one penny. That's important to take care of taxpayers' money. For the past 10 years here in Hillsborough County, I've worked for, as a real estate agent, a licensed real estate broker through the state of Florida for Century 21, as well as Martell Associates, a smaller firm, and now own my own corporation called Florida Property International. I've closed millions of dollars in transactions, including apartment buildings, retail strips, uh, small offices, hotel condominiums, and uh, a whole slew of uh, residential properties, of course. I think the experience that I have brings something to the appraiser's office. What I'd like to do, if elected appraiser, is see a lower set of value on uh, homeowners as well as small business property owners so that uh, they can thrive better than they currently are. Some folks are concerned that would hurt the budget. I think we can offset that by the second thing I'd like to do. I'd like to see corporate property owners pay a little bit more tax. And when I say corporate property owners, I'm talking about bank branches uh, or gasoline stations or big box retail. Uh, I want to thank you uh, most of all for doing this this evening. I wish every church would do this. It's a great way to get voters in contact with their uh, potential elected leaders. I very much thank you for your time. James Neal from Property Appraiser.